All right, people, so today I'm going to show you guys how to use my uh, new script for Pacey Bits FUT20. Uh, I'm going to be showing you how to do it in a virtual space, but I'll also explain how to do it if you have root access. First, I started a new game. There, we, uh, when you first start a new game, you want to make sure that you go here, open packs, and you open at least one of these packs. You only need to open one, uh, just to make sure your your file, your save file, is created. Okay, and you can just go back. But first, you see zero coins, zero tokens, and uh, eighteen players there. All right, so now you're gonna to wanna to close Pacey Bits. Close it all the way out. And then you'll, uh, well first, if you're a root user, only for root users, what you're gonna to wanna to do is you're gonna to wanna to go to the, uh, the, you know, the root directory of your phone. You're gonna to have to have a file explorer that's got root access. So go to the root directory of your phone, and go to data, data, I'm sorry, data, slash, data, slash, com, dot, pacybits, dot, pacybits, fut20, slash, shared, underscore, press, and inside that folder, you will find the file named com, dot, pacybits, dot, pacybits, fut20, dot, preferences, dot, xml. And for root users, you're going to copy that file and you're going to paste it into your download folder. All right. For virtual space users, you will run virtual backup, which you can download from the Game Guardian site. You need to be logged into your account on the Game Guardian site <clears throat> in order to download the file, but it's free to make an account, so just make yourself an account, download it. All right. So. <clears throat> Run virtual backup, press the backup button, select Pacey Bits, it says com.pacybits.pacybits FUT20 under it, so you make sure you got the right one in case you have the old one installed still. It might take a few seconds or a minute or so, I'm going real quick here, but it backed up, you can see all here that it's finished. Now you're going to go to uh, my modded Game Guardian. Close the news. Select the Pacey Bits FUT20 script. Enter your username and password from my website. <coughs> now here, here you're going to see basically the directions I'm giving you right now. So, you know, if you miss anything in the video, it's right here as well. Vice versa. So you can close this. Uh, first, we'll run add players and duplicates. That'll add all players that are currently in the game, plus 20 duplicates each. This is the one that takes the longest, but it really doesn't take that long. All right, it says all available players and 20 duplicates each have been added. Uh, lightning round packs at the moment it will set uh, any currently available lightning round packs to unlimited as in an unlimited amount you can buy and it will set the price to uh, one so that's already done there you go uh, add my packs this will add 1,000 each available type pack to the my packs tab there's about 12 different packs available there I think right now <clears throat> add player picks will add really ah okay I have not uh, gotten any player picks added yet this is going to be fixed shortly uh, by the time you're watching this video this should be fixed so that will add uh, all the player pa player picks in the game to the player picks tab um, the only reason it failed just now is because I actually have not have gotten any ever on this account. It's fresh, but again, that will be fixed probably by the time you guys are watching this. 
So I'm just gonna restart the script. And close that again. Uh, we're gonna add coins. 100 million is a maximum, so we'll do 100 million tokens. Um, I'm not sure what the maximum is, but I remember in 19, people had some issues giving themselves too many tokens and got banned, so I limited it to 3,000 tokens. And then uh, and the, unlock the badge collection. All right. So all that's done, you can press exit. You want to go back to virtual backup. This time we're going to hit restore. Again, pacey bits. So backup ended down here. This is done. <coughs> now we're going to start pacey bits. And if everything went right, I should now have all the players, all the badges, a bunch of packs. Again, Player picks uh, would be there if I had actually gotten one before I ran this, but I'll fix that so that won't be required for you to have anymore. All right, so here we go: a hundred million in coins, three thousand in tokens. Hold on, let's go back here. All the players, as you can see, duplicates, twenty of each. percent of the collection and my badges out oh, I forgot they just added more badges today I will get these added as soon as possible it unlocked most of the badges but all right so is there something else yes packs Lightning round packs. Here you can see I should have went if I had opened this up before I had ran that there probably wouldn't have been an error but anyways <clears throat> As you can see special packs set to infinite one each All the packs set to infinite one coin each uh, To go to my packs tab, you'll see you got a thousand of each of these I think that's about it. Well, you know, I think I'll just for the heck of it, I'm going to close this out and see if now that we've, I'll see now that's different. That's not, that's not one from the player pick tab. So never mind. I'll have the player picks pick shortly. <laughs> the player picks fix shortly. And uh, thanks to all the donors and all the people that have given me help with this, and this video will be crappy because I don't have a power director on my computer anymore after having to reinstall Windows, so I'm going to be using the mobile version. So we'll see how that goes. Have a good one.